G'day Steel Nation, G'day Steel Nation Worldwide, and G'day Steel Nation Universe. We have massive news. We have big news, guys. Massive, massive, huge news. The Pittsburgh still signed Tyron. Uh, no, we don't. The Pittsburgh Seals sign, according to Adam Kaplan, one of the blokes on Twitter. Man, there's so many dudes on Twitter, I don't even know who these dudes are. Like, I'm not a Twitter guy, right? So I have no idea who these dudes are. I should be more invested to Twitter. But overall, like my last video with the draft, I just don't overall care. All right? Now, we are signed. The Steelers, according to Adam Kaplan, whoever that bloke is, we are signing in other reports too. We are signing uh, former Eagles and Browns uh, linebacker for, and also defensive end, Gennard Avery, um, a one-year deal. Now, first of all, that's a very, a very good sign, a very good depth piece to our Steelers defense. Look, I'm only joking. I'm wearing Troy today. I wanted to get pumped up. I know I was a bit like down the dumps yesterday, like, oh, 31 reasons why I shouldn't do, talk about the draft. I do like I do like the overall scheme of the draft, but I just get a bit, uh, you know, it's just it feels like from Super Bowl to the NFL draft for three months, all we talk about is who we're going to get, and it, it it becomes a bit exhausting over over time. But what I do like talking about is players who we did get, who we did get, and the player who we did get is uh, linebacker here, and we'll go through his stats. Gerard Avery. Right, 56 games, 17 starts, 101 tackles, 7.5 sacks, 24 QB hits, and five pass deflections, along with, I think, one fumble, uh, forced fumble, and one fumble recovery, right? So, what does it mean for the overall defense? Uh, in reality, not too much, right? Not overly too much. He, to, to me, it's just, just adding another depth guy. Um, he probably will start outside of, you know, TJ Watt and Highsmith and, and be more of the depth guy because we have on our uh, outside linebackers list, the, the, the linebacking depth, we already have TJ Watt, Highsmith, and we have these four other blokes on the roster. Now, Derek Tutska or Zuska played a little bit last year. Taco Charlton played a bit too. The other two guys, John Simon, I think he used to be an ex-Patriot uh, ex guy, and Scott... Uh, Delonte, no idea who that guy is, to be honest. But where will he fit on this defense? He should play uh, a bit outside of the TJ Watt and Highsmith. And we do need the depth because what we do need is whoever does whoever does sign, you know, it, we're not even sure if he's going to make the team, right? You still have to go out there and 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 uh, make it past training camp, make it past the preseason, make it past, you know, need to be a pick for the team. So I'm excited though to, to bring someone in because he does look like a like a uh, a pretty big fella. Um, hopefully he can tackle and he can actually make a big uh, a, a difference on this defense. Because what I was trying to say is with TJ Watt there and Highsmith, these guys are going to get tired and they can't play 99% of snaps. You know you want to see TJ on the field in, in important downs um, and and set the presence for that defense as well. But you want to see him about 75 to 80% of the snaps and the other 20% can start to go to, you know, uh, Zutska. Man, I can't pronounce your name. Derek or Charlton. He's he's still un, he's still not signed yet. And maybe John Simon makes an impact too. So you need a rotation there. You need a rotation. And adding uh, Gerald Avery now is, is going to help the defense, I hope anyway, guys. Um, as you can probably hear, I don't know if you can hear, but if you ever live in a, in a man, is that? <laughs> it's like someone and they're grinding away. As I'm trying to do too, uh, segue. I am trying to grind away too, guys. Uh, we are on the road to 500, right? We're on the road to 500 subs, and I appreciate everyone coming in and saying hello and and, and trying to grow the community because I want to get to 500 so I can start to do community posts and talk about the Steelers more and more and more. So I appreciate you guys checking out the video. It's going to be a short one today. Um, not a massive signing like we're talking about Tyron Matthew. Not a big signing about si uh, re-signing. Edmonds, we're bringing in a guy for a chance. We're bringing in a guy, Avery, to sit behind and, you know, the depth guy, maybe he's a special teams guy that can help the team out with tackles and, and fumbles and, and, and stuff like that. Um, but I like it. I like the signing. It's a one-year deal. We don't know the money. It's only, only, probably only, only a short deal. But it's going to help this defense because we need help behind TJ Watt and Highsmith. When they get tired, we need other people to come in and start to help out, and I like it. I, I, I'm keen.
I don't care who wears the black and gold, man. As long as they come in and, and they're a good person, and if they're if they can uh, provide that you know strength to the defense, then I think we're all happy. So yeah, guys, uh, thanks for checking out Steel Nation Australia, and as always, here we go, Steelers. Here we go.